So what if this was that moment? Four chord. That chance worth taking. Five chord. History in the making. Now this is a very positive song. So that chord progression really works well. Songtown member Kevin Kurt asked me if I would go into a little bit about how I choose chord substitutions when I'm writing songs. He noticed that some of my songs went to some interesting places chord-wise. And rather than get into the theory behind why this chord works in relation to this chord, I thought I would keep it more like we do in pro writing rooms, where we're very practical about our choices. To me, chords are a big part of what sets the mood of your song. Um, they help kind of convey emotion and feeling in a big way. So a lot of times when I'm looking for chord substitutions, it's because I want to add a little bit more of a mood to something. So today I wanted to take a look at the four minor chord substitution. I call it the melancholy chord substitution or the reminiscing, you know, when you're looking back on something or, you know, wistfully looking back, all those descriptive things. That's what I think about when I think of the four minor chord. So to study this, I'm just going to take one of my songs I had out with Darius Rucker, play you a verse and chorus of his record and then let's take a look at it and I'll play the chorus and we'll say, what if we changed a chord at the end of the chorus and substituted the four minor? What feeling does that give us? Okay, here we go, y'all. This could be one of those memories I want to hold on to, cling to One that we can't forget Maybe this could be our last first kiss what if this was that moment, that chance worth taking, history in the making? Okay, so if you notice at the end, we do a classic 4-5-1 chord progression. So in the key of C, that would be F, G, C. So what if this was that moment? Four chord, that chance worth taking. Five chord, history in the making. Now this is a very positive song. So that chord progression really works well. You got the tension building. And then, ah. Release it on the one. But what if this lyric was more melancholy? And you wanted to have more of that reminiscing, looking back on an old love, maybe missing it a little bit, but, you know, grateful you went through it. Maybe that was the subject matter. A great chord substitution for this melancholy feeling is going to be a four minor. And anytime you have a song that has a five chord progression, going to a one, four, five, one. Anytime you have that, you can throw in the F minor chord substitution, the four minor. Four. So in this song, instead of, what if this was that moment, that chance we've taken, history in the make, instead of that, what? girl, we had our moments, was a chance we've taken. History in the making. F minor instead of a G. Four minor instead of a five. Easy chord substitution. It really gives you that melancholy flavor. And that's, like I said, that's what I look for in chords, is to give me a feeling. And if I'm going to deviate from the normal chord progression, it's going to be because I'm after a feeling. And this is a great example of how just changing that one chord can really change the whole feeling. Now, I don't want to do it if it's a really happy song, um, like History in the Making is, then I chose not to use that chord substitution. But if it was a different, you know, lyric, then that would have been a great choice to make. This could be one of those memories I want to hold on to, cling to One that we can't forget Maybe this could 
be our last first kiss Don't be forever But if this was that moment That chance worth taking